Good morning, friends and family. Javelin Joe here, Riders for Christ. We're going to be reading out of our book, Jesus Calling Sarah Young. April 11th, I hope your weekend went great. You can tell I'm not feeling very well right now, but uh, I have to be thankful according to the devotional. This is the day that I have made. Rejoice and be glad in it. Begin the day with open hands of faith, ready to receive all that I am pouring into this brief portion of your life. Be careful not to complain about anything, even the weather, since I am the author of your circumstances. The best way to handle unwanted situations is to thank me for them. This act of faith frees you from resentment and frees me to work my ways into your situation so that good emerges from it. To find joy in this day, you must live within its boundaries. I knew what I was doing when I divided time into 24-hour segments. I understand human frailty, and I know that you can bear the weight of only one day at a time. Do not worry about tomorrow or get stuck in the past. There is abundant life in my presence today. This is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in Psalm 118.24. Rejoice and be glad in it. Very difficult to do when you feel like I feel right now and felt like that all weekend. But God doesn't want me to complain. And when I start complaining, then I close the door to his invitation into my life i close the door to the things that he he wants to come in he wants to help me straighten things out he wants to help me get better he gives me ideas uh, you know to drink honey and tea or, or to take a you know an, an antibiotic or you know all those little things that he has there in place for us that we can do but when we get when we start complaining we miss it man we miss life life is a beautiful beautiful gift even when you're not feeling good even when things aren't going right that's why he wants you to stay in the now not just today but in the now this very minute the very next second just stay in the now and stay focused on him and i'm working on this i am struggling with this I've been struggling with this a long time but i'll be able to master this if i continue to train myself and i continue to try to do this Try to keep the door open to him. Try not to get bitter. Try not to get resentful. Try not to get angry. Try not to get caught in the past, worrying about what happened yesterday or the day before the, or the month before that. It's done. It's finished. Right now, this very minute, the next minute. First of all, we're not promised the rest of today. Okay, We're promised right now, this minute. Live in the minute. Not an easy thing to do, but it's an awesome, awesome gift if you can figure that out. And, gives God an opportunity to work in your life in every area. And, and and I'm I'm telling you, I'm working on it. My life was a mess for many years. And I've been working with the Lord now since I was 32 years old. I'm 50, so that's a long time to be walking with Jesus. A pretty good long time. And I tell you, my life isn't what it was, and it's getting way better. And I do enjoy the day, even when I don't feel so good. So have a great day. Be encouraged today. Know God loves you. And give it to Him today.